Okay, so the guys at Through Night have come up trumps again. They've sent me this, one of their latest editions. This is the TC15. I don't know if you can see on there. And again, usual story, great packaging, all recyclable or recycled. It's another sort of pen light type. Again, all this nicely recycled packaging. There we go. Quite compact. Still relatively chunky. Well, not chunky, what's the word? You know you've got it in your hand. It's not light, like a cheap and nasty thing, but it's uh, it's real good quality. It's the, t the um, aircraft grade aluminium. So what else do we get in the box? As usual, there's always quite a few bits. Instructions, warranty card. Um, your micro USB charger because it's a rechargeable one again which it seems to be the way they're going or everything's going at the moment and it's brilliant I love the rechargeable stuff um, carry case now I've got quite a few of these cases now but I never seem to use them I wish I could find a really good use for them it seems a shame not to use them but um, you've got big belt loop there clip you could hang it on a, a rucksack or whatever then you've got your accessories we've got the lanyard which I always use then we've got two big seals they're the um, USB cover seals and two of the smaller seals for the oh, come out I'll show you them if I can get them out they're basically for the threads anyway. I can't get them out, but you can probably see they're two small ones. And then this tiny little one, which I always forget to mention. It's a tiny, tiny little thing. Uh, and that's for under the button. It goes under the button, which makes it all waterproof. Um, I generally forget to mention that one, but they always send that as well as all these other bits and pieces. So, what have we got? Let's just see if I can put this lot back in my fingers aren't working very well today right let's get rid of that lot so um, usual story um, you press a long press I don't know if it's come on yeah you can't actually see it very well it has come on that's the firefly mode and once it's on you hold it and it will cycle through all the modes and back again. So you've got low, medium and high. And then when you get to high, or any in any mode actually, give it double tap and you get the turbo mode, which is really sort of bright. Double tap again, you get the strobe, which is quite a useful mode. Um, now this puts out 2,300 lumens. Now that's really something else. Um, I know you probably think every time they send me a new one I always say it's the best thing I've ever seen. Well, it is because they keep improving them. They keep upping the game. Um, and this again runs on the rechargeable... Let's get it out. Eighteen eight one eight 1.8650 3,100 milliamp hour rechargeable batteries. Um, comes with it, obviously. Oh, nice seal around there. And there's one up this other end as well, making it waterproof, dust proof, and all sorts of proof. Your charging port is up the top here. Now, compare that with the previous one they sent me. It's almost identical size and shape, but this one, the Neutron 2C, is only 1100 uh, lumens with the same battery um, and similar modes. So they've really upped their game in the same size package. Um, again, this I forgot to mention comes with the uh, belt clip. So you can stick it in a pocket. Let's see if I can get that off. 
and it's not gonna you're not gonna lose it um, really nice little torch um, I do like through night stuff I get asked to do an awful lot of reviews and I turn down hundreds um, because I don't like the product or the company looks a bit iffy but through night are a jolly good company I've um, been thoroughly impressed by all their products so you know I'm not just doing it because they give me a, a, a flashlight I'm doing it because I really like their products so anyway I'll put all the links to the, where you can buy it and all the rest of it and all the specifications in the description but what we'll do next we'll go outside once it gets dark which it isn't at the moment and we'll give it a little test actually before we go out and give it a test I'll just run you through the um, charging modes there's a if you haven't seen any of my previous through night videos there's a tiny tiny little um, where is it in the middle there that's a light let's see if you can see it and probably can't see it when it's on but trust me there's a little light in there um, when it's blue everything's running fine once it gets down to red it will still work but it's telling you it needs charging when it gets really low it'll start to flash uh, and then you know you've got very little left uh, and if it goes purple heaven forbid I've never had one go purple yet you've got a problem with the uh, the torch somewhere uh, and it's, it's also has got a, a quite a nice little feature built in this particular one um, ITC technology I don't quite know what ITC stands for but basically what it does if it gets too hot the the LED chip um, the torch will actually turn itself down it won't turn it off but it will turn itself down so that it, it cools it um, so that's quite a nice little safety feature so you know it's not gonna you know burst into flames or or pack up completely and something else I've just noticed on this one which I haven't noticed on others but I've just seen now I've said it it does have it um, the there's a rubber ring around here I thought it was for um, sort of extra grip or something, but when I look, I realise it's actually the port cover. So ignore that. That's just part of the port cover. So there you go. That's the, the sort of uh, light uh, meanings for the, 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 the charging light on the button. So let's wait for it to get dark and we'll go out and give it a go. Right, so it's about 11 o'clock at night. So I don't think it's going to get any darker, and that's firefly mode. And in the daylight, that looks actually quite dim. But at night, it's, it's adequate for you know if you were in a room with other people asleep, and you wanted to have a quick look round, didn't want to disturb them, or you wanted to do, do a bit of reading, absolutely adequate. So let's go outside, try the other modes. Right, let's see if I can work it out. That's low which disappears sort of halfway up the garden but again would be adequate medium and high and that for such a small package low medium high medium high and that is turbo mode which I say for such a small flashlight is incredible that really does light up the garden I don't think I should be needing that very often. And then you've got the strobe mode, which they say is uh, useful for blinding attackers or drawing attention to yourself. I think you might struggle to blind attackers because it takes a couple of sort of goes to get to it. But anyway, it's quite could be quite useful. So you can just about see on low, medium, high, low, medium, high. It uh, cycles through if you hold your finger on the button. But I can't believe it. That is really, really impressive for such a small thing. Another one that's going to become very useful. So there you go. The links are in the description. And there's also a discount code. So check it out. Thanks for watching.